Hello and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will walk you through the new update that Google Analytics 4 has released on how to count conversions. So let us go back to the Google Analytics platform. So here I am in the admin section and I am in the events tab. So here you can see there are few default events. Now let us say I want to mark this video underscore complete as a conversion, right? So I want to mark this, this event as conversion. So what I will do, I will simply uh, toggle this on so that it will mark as conversion, right? So from now on, all the conversions that are triggered for this event will be uh, seen under the conversion tab. So here I am in the conversion tab. And now here you can see, uh, since we marked that event as conversion, now it is showing us here, right? So this is how we generally we mark the we mark the events as conversions in GA4, right? So from now on, the counting mechanism of conversions will be changed. So here you can see for this event there is a three dotted icon, right? So if you click on this, here is the new update that got released uh, from Google Analytics change counting method. So how how are you counting conversions will now be updated, right? So let me click on this change counting method. So before this update, the default option, how Google Analytics for, was calculating conversions was, it was taking every event, it was counting every event as conversion, right? But now with this option, with this counting method update, here you can see we, now we can use this now we can tell Google to count an event as conversion only once for a particular session, right? So count an event as conversion for one once per session, right? So this this is the option that we have to choose. If you don't want to duplicate your conversions, then this is the option that is recommended, right? Although GA4 is recommending this option, but if you use this option, each each user can submit forms multiple times and it will be recorded as two conversions. But if you use this option, uh, it will count only as one conversion for one session, right? So this is the better option. So once you select this, click on save. So once you click on save, here you can see a small icon is getting displayed here. This means from now on this event will be counted as once per session, right? So that is the update that GA4 has uh, recently released, right? So this is, a, this is a better option to track, to count conversions in GA4 without duplicating your conversion data, right? I hope this, uh, this video was helpful to you. If you have any questions on GA4, then let me know and uh, Please like and subscribe to my channel so that I can make much more videos on GA4. Thank you.